Yow. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to our interview segment. Uh, I am here with Flushy from Team Xenix. And uh, we're just going to start this off by just, you know, uh, breaking down how things went for you. Um, you know, the highs and the, the difficulties. Uh, just, you know, how the tournament uh, evolved for your team. Yeah, I mean, um, can't really lie to you, x -Tan. I think uh, the tournament was a bit of a disappointment for us. Um, certainly, um, from a, on a personal level, I know my teammates aren't fully happy with um, how they played over the whole course of the tournament and the consistency that we were weren't, weren't really able to show map to map. We had some great moments. Um, you know, we were able to compete with every single team here. Like when everybody was on was 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 playing on point. Um, you know, we were able to beat full tilt three 0 on Viaduct. Uh, you know, that's that's the potential we were capable of. So to not really show that over the course of the whole tournament and to go a little bit deeper, I have to I have to admit it's slightly disappointing. On a personal level, and also as the the the, uh, the in-game leader, it's uh, slightly disappointing. So yeah. Um, how has your uh, impressions of this LAN in general been? Uh, has it been a good time for you? Has it been easy to settle in? Uh, what's been going on? Uh, LAN's, LAN's, LAN's absolutely awesome. Um, you know, there's something to be said for just getting a bunch of, bunch of gamers together in a room and playing, uh, playing video games. It, it's, it's really, really good fun and meeting people. Um, Friday was a bit, bit scrappy. Um, I'm not going to lie to you. I thought the, the, I, th I think the admins, they always do a good job, but the service could have been handled a little bit better. That was a bit scrappy. Um, overall, the venues, the venues unbelievable. Uh, the venues super cool. Uh, the the tournament, tournament was was well well run at the end uh, at the end of the day on on, on Saturdays especially. So um, yeah, it's been a, it's been a very decent land. Awesome. And um, so you guys definitely showed a lot of potential, like you mentioned. You had players like Funs who, who had some awesome moments. Uh, what does the future hold for you guys? Uh, what are you guys looking forward to? Um, are you guys going to keep competing in the Premier ETF2L, uh, look for the other events and whatnot? What, what's going on? What's, what's the future for Team Xenix? Yeah, so, um, you know, first of all, a massive shout out to uh, Jamie Gizmo, who's the, uh, who's the owner of Xenix. Um, he picked us up on relatively short notice, so massive shout out to him. He's been very, very good in terms of just giving us everything we needed. And if it was um, last minute headsets, last minute keyboards and mice uh, for Stefan, he was able to provide that. So massive shout out to him. They're a, they're a great organization. I, I don't think many people in, um, in Europe have really heard of that organization because it's primarily a UK based organization. Um, super cool company. I think, I, think we, I, think they, I think we can do a lot in TF2 with Xenix. Um, I certainly plan on trying to maintain that relationship. Um, in terms of the team, like as you asked, um, there will definitely be some changes coming up. Obviously, Stefan was kind of murking for us. It wasn't like he was playing for us um, as, a, as a, a long, steady member of the team. So I just got to see wh what his situation is. Tiger, um, he's got a new job. So uh, I wish Connor all the best. He did, he did, he did absolutely great in a couple of maps. Um, thanks very much to him for playing his heart out. Um, but m there might be a couple of spots opening up. I certainly plan on, um, you know, if there's a if there's a team around that we can form that can compete with the likes of Crowns and Full Tilt, uh, I'd certainly like to be a part of that. But um, but who knows? Who knows? Yeah. Nice. What uh, sort of improvements uh, do you want to make uh, to your game? Like, what sort of lessons did you learn from from your play in this land, and and how do you want to improve yourself as a player moving forward on, on the medic position? Um, on the medic position specifically, I I personally felt that I had a I had a very, very good land. I think my um, the way that I was healing my team, um, the way that I was calling for my team, I thought was pretty good. Um, it's just a shame that we weren't really able to execute. And, and, and of course, we made some mistakes. Um, you know, if, if we probably had done a, a few things here and there a little bit better, we could have run it around a little, maybe a little bit deeper. But I, th I thought personally I played quite well. Um, yeah, it was just a couple of other things which 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 let us down. So um, slightly disappointing. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, you guys definitely though, as we mentioned, we got we guys got potential. I'm sure that you'll be able to form a, a strong team, like you were saying. And um, well, uh, don't know if I have any more direct questions for you. So I'll just uh, let you uh, run down some more shoutouts though. Give some love to the people out there at home. Yeah, massive uh, massive shout out to all the support. It's been really cool to get messages on Steam saying uh, good luck for the tournament. Sorry, we weren't, we weren't really able to uh, achieve our goal of fourth place. We came one step short. But uh, yeah, again, shout out to Jamie, uh, Jamie Gizmo of Xenix. Uh, shout out to our sponsor, Sam Blaster, um, a Rosy web host for you. It's a bit of a funny one, but uh, yeah, shout out to those guys. Thanks, thanks very much for support.
Awesome. Well, yeah, you guys definitely had a good showing and uh, appreciate you coming on for this interview and sharing some of your insights uh, about what happened for your team. So thanks so much for, uh, again for joining me, Flushy, uh, the medic for Team Xenix. And well, ladies and gentlemen, we'll be back with uh, another uh, interview coming up. We'll have uh, Paulson from Jasmine T uh, joining me next time. So please uh, don't head anywhere. We'll be right back.